Hi guys, welcome back to Forking Around Kampala. Today I'm at Cafe Seri. Cafe Seri is located in Acacia Mall in Kisamenti. It's been open since 2014. And one of the things I love about Cafe Seri is its diverse menu, ranging from their Italian coffee to their French bakery and even their continental menu. But today I'm here to look at their latest indulgence, their frozen yogurt, located at Yoguseri, the cutest little stall. Come, let's check it out. Hi guys, I'm finally at Yoguseri and I'm here with Karen and Carol. These lovely ladies are here to school me on just what it takes to run a business like this. So tell me, how long has Yoguseri been open? So Yoguseri has been open for three months. Okay. We opened recently. We started with a soft ice cream and frozen yogurt. Okay. Whereby you can add a few toppings to your frozen yogurt. And the best part is you're not restricted to one. You can okay. choose a variety of toppings, you know, yeah. let's say you want to mix the passion and the cookies, it's totally fine. Okay. Then, um, yeah, basically that. We do uh, yogurt shakes as well. Yeah. So instead of the milkshakes, you know, people know milkshakes where they use ice cream and the milk. We yes. use the yogurt. Okay. That's the unique part as well. Okay. When you said limited, how many toppings can one put on, let's say, one serving of Froyo. Uh, they can put about three or four toppings. Three or four? Yes. So stingy. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. That's enough. That's enough. Okay. So um, tell me, what's your best seller here? Well, our best seller is the frozen yogurt. Okay. Yeah. Is there one in particular? I see you have different flavors. Is yes. there one flavor in particular that sells best? Yes. I would say the wild berry because wild it has berry. a very fruity taste and okay. it's sweet. So the children love it. The adults love it. It's just a neutral flavor for everybody. Mm. Okay. So guys, let's, if we have to have a look here and see what flavors, you have, what toppings you have here. You have some of the, the rainbow, you have some Oreos. What else do you have here? You have some nuts? Yes, some we do. Some brownies? Yes, we do. We do have a passion, and watermelon, passion. yeah, and the marshmallows as okay. well. Okay. And then you also have the cones, the gelato cones. Yes, that's uh, for the soft ice cream. Okay. You know? While you're eating your soft ice cream or frozen yogurt, let's say you can munch away on the corn and... Yeah. Yeah. So this, I'm sure, is frequently flocked by kids and parents who are probably living and trying to get out of a mall, but their kids are just glued here. Yeah. So what, what do you have for the parents? Well, for the parents, we do have uh, juices, fresh juices. So the fresh juices, if somebody, not only parents, if somebody doesn't like uh, dairy products, yeah. they could also opt for the fresh juices. That's true. Well. There's a lot of parents that actually do love Froyo. I was just saying that in case, you know, yeah. you have quite a range over here. Okay, and then you have um, something else going on over here because I see a hot plate. And I know you don't need a hot plate to make Froyo, so tell me a bit about that. Well, uh, we do have the donuts. Okay. Yeah, the donuts. So the donuts, we top them up either with chocolate or chocolate and coconut or icing. Okay. We do the crepe as well, sweet and savory crepe. Yeah. For the savory, we use the cheese. For the sweet, you can put cinnamon, icing, sugar, chocolate, wild berry sauce. Yum. Your choice. <laughs> it sounds so good. Okay. And then the best part is that we have the waffle on a stick. The waffle on a stick? Yes. So okay. it's more like, you know, when you have meat on a stick. So this yeah. is something sweet. Okay. So that's what makes it unique. Not many places have the I'm waffle not, on yeah. a stick. I'll give you that. I've not seen a waffle on a stick yet. So this is pretty unique. And what toppings can you put on a waffle on a stick? Uh, you can put the Nutella sauce, chocolate okay. sauce, uh, yeah. wild berry sauce. Yeah. You can even put some sprinkles or marshmallows or chocolate balls. Yeah. Passion fruit as well. Okay. Yeah. Well, this all sounds so good. I'm very tempted now. I need to try something. So perhaps you guys could tell me what should I try, and then maybe I could create my own fusion of toppings on my. What do you recommend? Okay. So I would recommend the wild berry. The you wild can berry. actually mix it up with a pop-up flavor. That's coconut for today. Okay. Pop-up flavor. Yes. So every day you have a different one. Yes, we do. I love that, guys. <laughs> Um, so I'm definitely going to try the pop-up flavor and wild berry. Okay, so, so how do I do this? we're going to grab a cup just here. Okay. And then we can hold it. Then we shall use the middle lever to mix the two flavors. 
Okay, so this would just would be the bubble one. alone? Yes, the that would be the wild berry alone. This is like so you're going to put it in here. Okay. Then when you're letting it out of the machine, you're going to rotate the cup so just that like it that. can go in a, all the way to the top. Okay, okay. Let's try my coordination out there. Okay. All the way. Ooh. There. Okay. I was a little bit greedy with this one. <laughs> but um, I think I did okay. Yeah. Okay, great. So, now, should I, should I, let me just try the throw your first. Okay. Just to give you guys an honest review because that's what I always do give honest reviews. Uh, well, we import the ingredients from Israel and different parts of the world. We from look Israel. for the yes. Okay. We look for the best quality ingredients so that we can give quality products to our customers. And then the fruity flavors, we get them from here because Africa is very well known for nice yes. fruits because yes. of their soils. That's why. Wow. Well, this is delicious. But I just I need some topping. Okay. Um, thank you so much guys and try the Lucy Froyo the next time you're at your Lucery. Carol will be here or Karen will be here and they'll help you hook it up. But thank you for having me guys. Yes, I'm thank so you. So appreciative. I've taken over but hey, you're happy to find one of these guys here next time. Love you guys. Till next time. Hi. Hi. What can I get for you today? No, I really well, actually, I recommend the Lucy Froyo. It's the best seller here at Yogurt Series. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I'll take that. Yeah? Yeah. What size okay. would you like? Uh, let me do small. Small? Yeah. I'm new to this, so... You're new to it. You're yeah. going to love it. You might come back. This was a good one. This was a good one. How long have you been doing this? So, um, I've been doing this for three months now. Uh -huh. As long as Yogurt Series has been open. Uh -huh. Um and basically it's, it's just been the best seller ever since it's been open i don't know what it is some girl called lucy created it uh -huh. um, <laughs> do you have a good dentist by the way because you might start living it so i'm throwing some brownies on top I Please. Don't know if yeah okay. that's part of it right that's that's, that's what what do you call it again the lucy froyo the lucy froyo yeah that's part of the lucy froyo yes the Part of the Lucy Froyo and then throw on some chocolate syrup. Nice. Oh, gosh. Divine, eh? I think I'm going to have to make an appointment soon. Yeah. With okay. my dentist, yeah. We have some wild berry syrup. What's new? Wild berry, yeah. yeah. This is new, actually. I've never um, heard of that. Right. So, and then I just need to give you a nice spoon. Hey. There you have it. Wow. The Lucy Froyo. Lucy Froyo. You should try and give me an honest review. So winner? Yeah. That's why it's the best. Two thumbs up. Yay!